You're short now. Did you do? Hi, Stefan. Hi, Rene. Stefan is uh, Team uh, North Star <gasps> with the shirt and everything. Yes. And we are playing with, uh, well, Stefan has several North Star discs in his bag. I have a wingman first run and I have a first run spy in the premium plastic. What's the name of the plastic? Um, I'm pretty sure that plastic you got is the one called Sea Line. Sea Line. It's um, just like all the other yeah, companies. Sea Line, I have so. I have a lot of different stuff, so I'm just oh, really gonna very, pull, very gummy. pull something up here to show. So the spy is supposed to be a little bit like a zone. Is that correct? Yeah, that's pretty correct. Let the numbers are four three zero three on the spy. Yeah. And the wingman is five five zero two, so fairly straight. So here you got all the moles that I have. It's different moles. So Sea Line Wingman, which is the mid-range. It's kind of, I'll describe it as a mix between a rock, rock X and a boss. It has glide like a boss, but stability like a rock. A mix between a rock and a hard place. <laughs> Sorry. That's fine. <laughs> then I have a Zoom, which is the putter. Uh, this is a proto prototype. So. Um, if you're going to see me throw this, it's going to be a bit more understable than what the final outcome is going to be. And that's also in the sea line plastic. Looks a lot like a P2, but you know. Yeah, it is uh, kind of that direction. The Spy in the NS line. And this is super, this is the flat version. Yeah, this is absolutely This is actually flat. Maybe, a little, maybe a little bit concave. Yeah. And I've seen some in the factory that are super concave. The Spy I have is a little bit puddle top. So super concave, uh, it's seven off, it has launcher stand, but it's not launcher, it's a spy, yeah. this one. But yeah, uh, and then we also have um, the launcher here that just, uh, that also just came out. And there's both the normal, the S and the OS. So this is the NS, the NS plastic as well, but different stability due to the plastic is different. So the mold is the same. But the plastic makes it the different stabilities uh, after testing with uh, uh, Peter, who makes all these from Nosta, found out of this. And then, of course, it was smart to make runs with an overstable, stable, understable. And he's been testing yeah. it with several different plastic that he's gotten new batches on, and it's been the same every time. Yeah. And there's a little bit of yeah, production, yeah. difference in the production. Yeah. yeah. And so, then, you have, so you have three discs in one. That's yeah. nice. And then the last mold that I have is the Pacific. And this is the Pacific OS in the SN plastic. I also have one in the Sea Line plastic. Um, and this is a very overstable um, fairway driver. I also have it in actually in the normal plastic S Line, which is straight. And I also have it as an understable. So I have this in every single mold that exists. So both from super overstable to very workable for my arm speed. So this might be a good side on this company, maybe. Yeah, it's, uh, I'll, it's, I'll try it out. It's firebirdish, but with a lot more glide. So Ooh. probably towards a, if you, if you, I don't like to compare because they're their own. And I think they're better than everything that I'm going to compare them to. <laughs> but to give you people a little bit of knowledge, I would say this is towards a PD and the driver is towards a mix between a destroyer and a boss, basically. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. But I'm, so the, the numbers, let's just go over the numbers real quick. For the Pacific, it's a speed 10. What does it say? Five, ten, gl ten, glide 5, five zero, zero, turn. 0 turn and 3 in, uh, and that's in that, low speed stability. So that, that, that's in the OS. And if you get a S, it's, uh, I don't have one stamp. I think it's 10, 6, minus 1, 2. And if you get the US, I think it's 10, 6, minus 2, 2. Quite I'm not the, quite sure, but uh, maybe the numbers will get up on the screen. So, but it's only, I don't have the Paladin, which is the last one that he's also have made that hasn't come out yet, but it's the last one. I don't have that with me, but that's uh, towards the T-Bird ish. And the drivers are the only one that exist in uh, every single plastic type. Yeah. So like um, the launcher, the Pacific, the Paladin, they have uh, where they exist in OS, S and okay. US. The, not in the mid ranges, not in the uh, approach and not in the putter. Just in the drivers. Yeah. Awesome. So we're at a local course here. Uh, there's yeah. going to be a separate playthrough for, for the course. We're just going to be throwing some plastic. Did I yeah. press record? Yes, I did. <laughs> no. Yeah. Let's see. 
Well, but I'm going to try. 69 meters. Yeah, the basket is like right before the green stuff sticking off far up there. So I just hope I can get this one up there. It's the first shot of the day. Can't really expect and anything too great of this. Disc golfers say, <laughs> well. Oh, get around. Oh, that's, that's too early. Too early. I think I'm going to be in the bush oh, right I in front of the basket. the basket. But it did what I expected to do. Well, look out. Here comes Mr. Griplock. Nope. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, like I said, it's, it's quite overstable, that one. Beefy. Um, well, I am here. And since the only putter I have is a spy, <laughs> then that's, uh, you know, try the spy. So I don't, I've never thrown a zone, but I've thrown harps. And they uh, are, um, maybe a tad faster than the harp. There's a little bit of a headwind here. Yeah. So I'm hoping to let it ride on the wind. Yep. That was uh, better than expected. So Stefan is, uh, Stefan is parked, even though he wasn't expected, expecting to be. <laughs> so the Zoom in premium plastic, amazing putter. I can't miss from here. Pretty. Hey, first hole completed with no star only. Okay, so hole number two. Pacific. Pacific is? Pacific is. Pacific is Pacific US. Maybe US. Yeah. This one is a bit more beaten, so it's actually a little bit more flippy than the US. You will see that in a second. Uh, I'm going to go backhand. What is you doing? Sidearm. Sidearm. And we have right to left wind and it's kind of pushing like towards us, like headyish yeah. backwards wind, yeah. It's pretty hot. It's gonna be interesting with this one. Oh yeah. Let's try it out. See, slight flip. Oh, and that's... then it gets very overstable in the end. Yeah. And, and that's with the wind out there. Yeah. And for me, it would be best if it was really windy to keep the disc up. Now it is. Yes. Yeah. But yeah, it's yeah. it's too beefy for my arm, actually. Of course, we have the good microphones on today, so no one can actually hear how windy it is. Wow, that thing is beefy. Yeah, but still, it's okay release. I think it's uh, good. Should we try launcher? Yeah. No, I think like a Heiser with a to try out different disc with the normal launcher, launcher S. The numbers in this one is not correct. It is a 13, five minus one three. This is again a proto, proto, proto. So, but it flies true to what the normal North, uh, North Star launcher flies like right now. So it's very true to the numbers. See how it glides in the wind. Wow. Comes back over stable. Oh, right that was pretty good. Yeah. Damn. Golasso through the goal. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, yeah, yeah. This should be a perfect uh, spy up shot yeah. opportunity, right? Definitely. And I'm a little bit uh, nervous here because. Uh, I've, I have a tendency to grip lock. Well, it's very overstable, Potter, so better grip lock and stuff like early that, release. But, but you know, slow is smooth, smooth is far, blah, 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 blah. Interchange. Interchange. Oi! 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 <laughs> Me, David. I'm not going to say anymore for the finish, guys. I <laughs> really want the birdie and I don't have a proper putter from them yet. They, they just made them this week, I know. So, but I haven't had time to go there. So I'm gonna putt with my old putters. First run something, I'm not telling you who. Dwing. Yep. Ah. Ah. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's kind of like a, like a sinus. I know also, another guy in Denmark that if he had to play with another brand, he would probably like that one. Maybe. To putt with. Probably. <laughs> No names mentioned. <laughs> no name, no shame. Yeah. 
Jeg tager en smilade. Jeg skal ikke sådan en TikTok. Den sidste. Launcher. I need to get out there. Heiser to the left. Someone has moved the goal. Used to be over there. Kind of annoying. It kind of makes the whole change every time hey, you play. Should I try the uh, this launcher instead and see? Yeah, if... sure. Yeah. Definitely not a forehand though. No, no. <laughs> forehand roller. Almost gold. That's exact. I'll try and throw the Pacific again here. Yeah. Back backhand. Slow is smooth, and smooth is something. Yeah, overstable getting around the yeah. corner. For me, that was fine. I think that's a good shot. Yeah. So, well, it's just the same shot. One more time. One more time. One more time. Well, I've, the idea is to get it for that way and hope it fades over in front of the hole somewhere. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be close to the hole at all. Maybe, maybe I am. I don't know. You got it. Nope. Nah, that's not too bad. But that's not too bad. You, yeah. you have a heiser into the hole now. Yeah. Ah, okay. Stefan is here. Yeah. I'm up here. Basket is if over I, there. If I had a forehand here, I would any day of the week go and throw a forehand that way up and high in. Hey, but try, try and throw a forehand. Uh, Come on. That's my second shot. Uh, yeah. Because first, I'm trying to beat a course record out here as well. Uh, well only with an all start, that would be fun. I know it's minus eight, and I have went minus eight on the 12th course layout, so I can probably make it go minus nine on the 13, I hope. But uh, I'm gonna go for the high stop over here first with the launcher, normal one, and trying to see if I can get it up there and get it to like somehow get down around the basket and not fade too much. I think that's actually okay. Might be a little long, but I think it's okay. Well, you said a forehand? Yeah. I have a launcher OS. Because Stefan has a history of saying, I don't know how to, how to throw a sidearm, and then he throws a perfect sidearm. And the, 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 the issue here is that it's so long. <laughs> no, it isn't. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. <laughs> Fine, okay. <laughs> this flying will fly in. Yeah. Oh, wow. Ah. Ah, that makes me so geil. Excellent. <laughs> you may or you may or may not have just heard music there instead of Stefan. <laughs> oh yeah. Oof, it's in. Service is in. I'm here, and I'm supposed to be there, so uh, yeah, kind of sucks, but it's not a problem because I have a spy I can jump out with, and I'm gonna like make it a dagger dagger, dagger in the change. Get in the chains. Yeah, come on, come on. Ah! Come on. Hey, uh, throw it again until you make it. Okay, so the basket is up there to the right, a yes. little bit in and to the right. The wind is coming from right to left. Stefan is throwing a what? I'm throwing a very beat up wingman, so it flies nothing like a new wingman does, but if you play with it enough, it will fly like this. I would compare this one to almost fuse level, like a stable fuse. And I've aced this hole, but I won't say the disc name, but I might have said it already. <laughs> We're gonna try. It's hard with the backhand because you need this like l low turn or flip, but let's try it. That's too oh, low. Too low. Don't throw it on a hyzer into the fucking on the backhand and have it stay right. I'm gonna try side on with the uh, somewhat understable Pacific. For Stefan, understable Pacific. I'm gonna throw it with a little bit more hyzer this time yeah. and actually try and flick it in there. Yeah, good idea. The idea yeah, fight, was fight, fight, fight. The idea was okay, and yeah. I think actually there is there is some looks from there. It's better than where I am. Let's just say that. 
Yeah, first. then I'm going to go. I'm going to try the, uh, the launcher as well. Launcher Just US. Much better. Than the big skip. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but it's good. Oh, what did we say? Here. In a bad spot. Ooh, get in. Oi! That could have been fun. So, and on. I am over here with the Pacific and the uh, launcher landed there. So, I have nothing. Nothing. Well, I have a spy. Nothing. I have a spy and there's, the, yeah, there's a, like a flex line thing. Yeah. If I can just miss that last bush. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh! Right in the middle of the trees. Ow! Mm. It makes you feel alive. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's a, nice another one. par. You also have to put in mind that this course is pretty new, so it will be very rough. Yeah. yeah. So the basket here. is there. If you can throw a long sidearm like Aston, just have it keep the turn and then come back in the last second. Yeah. You can birdie it. For people like me, I uh, and me and lots of other people who are not Aston. Big love it has to choose. It has to choose. You know, actually, I'm gonna mm -hmm. I'm gonna do the sidearm with the launcher here. You do that. And, uh, I am gonna take my super puddle top, uh, found at the factory in the trash can, um, <laughs> what's it called, uh, spy, with yeah. new launcher OS stamp on. And he, he, he has more of those. So yeah, and this is show you the difference with, with between the spies we've been throwing and a puddle top, because this is gonna be extremely beefy. Oh wow! Like I said, we're talking probably a little less than a justice, but it's there. What if what if you threw a less beefy zone, uh, not zone, uh, spy? So you actually land in the fairway, maybe? Would you land in the fairway? No, I think it would go too straight. I have a baseline spy here, really? which is also pretty stable, but I think it's going to go too straight for me. Apparently not. No, same. <laughs> okay. No, I just threw that one a lot higher. Okay, I'm gonna try this. And I suddenly realize how big that tree is. It's so small. It's so big. It's not there. It's so fucking big. No, okay, well, I'm gonna launch this. I'm gonna launch this. <laughs> Whoa! <clears throat> He's still alive, folks, don't worry. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, oh, it was so close to being clean. Damn, that was nice. What's going on? You all of a sudden became good. Seriously, I know that why. Was, that was a pretty good shot. <laughs> oh, shit. He all of a sudden became good, and I know why. Why? Why? Stop. Why, Stefan, why? North Star! North Star! <laughs> At least there are no thorns in here. Uh, they, will came, they, they will come more later, don't you worry. Hey, I have a uh, long, long any look with this, uh, any ish look with the wingman. Wow! Okay, into a tree. I heard that. Way, I get to try a sidearm with the wingman from over here. Yeah, it can handle it, it can handle the torque. Wow. That's a putt. Yeah, definitely. There's, going to, there's going to be two versions of this video. One where Stefan is singing and one where he's not. Oh, that's a putt. Yeah. So Stefan just made his putt. 
with my zoom. My zoom. If you don't believe me, I'll go back and make it again with my zoom. I'm going to putt with the wingman because that worked pretty well. And now you're going to hear me talking about Stefan making the putt again. With the zoom. With the zoom. So, Stefan is taking the Pacific. Pacific, yes. Pacific normal Pacific here. We have a very stiff headwind, so it might flip a lot. Let's see. And the basket is way up there somewhere. Just oh, flip that. flat turns. Wow. But yeah. I'm gonna take a wingman in the NS plastic. It's, it's not called anything else, but in my feeling, I found it to be less stable than the sea line that you're flowing with. Um, Still reliable. I'm, I'm actually very intrigued. That's why I also want to throw it to see how it acts into this kind of headwind. I have a feeling it might flip and hold the ante very well. But let's figure it out. Oh, yeah, that flipped. Ah. It went in too early. That's not good, but it did what I expected it to do. But I'm not, I'm not very smart. So I'm going to try and throw through this. Oh, no. I don't know how it landed here. I threw from over there and I, I didn't throw down here, I threw it up there. I don't know how, but it's here. <laughs> I take this, put this, and I say, hey, I took a part, and I say, hello. When you get over 40 and you get up too fast, you get all dizzy. <laughs> That's why we don't smoke weed in this age, we just get up fast. It's yeah. a lot smarter. Stand up quick, yeah. too quickly. Oi. Oh, yeah, well, fairway is. You know what? That was new. Spy in the sea line plastic. Just to see what I can do. Oh, oh, oh. That was pretty good. Ah, good try. Gave it a go. Say no, no. I said your shot looked good, but that's because I thought it was. It was fine. It was easy. Yeah, yeah. Easy putt. Easy putt. Long, longer putts look better on YouTube. Yep. Zoom. Zoom, zoom. Zumba. Zoom, zoom. I was thinking about a spy, but I just think the zoom is the right choice, just to throw it nice and calm. Yeah, it's okay. It's a putt. Yeah, I think so. So if I throw it with a little, a little bit flat, maybe with a little hyzer and just hammer it. I think it will pretty yeah. much hold the line then. Yeah. Is it? Too much nose up. Yeah, but it's, it, it's still resistant. It's yeah. not like cutting over. I'm in here. Basket is right there. All of these have thorns. Nice. Nuts. Come on. Well. Easy bar. A heel. Easy bird. Yes. Zoom bird. Zoom, 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 zoom. <laughs> Tailwind. Like. Yes. <laughs> it's going that way and it's going fast. Look at look at the grass. Wow. I'm gonna try the Pacific, normal Pacific here. I just wanna try and keep it on the fairway. Okay. It's larger than uh, the neutral one. Yeah. That was way too early out of my hand. Skip forwards. Uh, luckily not okay, deep. So the basket is right on the corner. Yeah. Baseline spy. Little long. <laughs> I tried it! Ta-da! Almost didn't make it over in the tailwind, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I'm probably gonna throw my uh, Pacific OS, the clear one. That's uh, severely overstable. It looks like the, like, the, like the square box plastic. <laughs> it is so overstable, it's done. <laughs> hate this hole. 
If you want North Star to be one more for landfill player package next year, let me know in the comments below. I think Stefan is going to throw one more. No, he's not. Too low, the wingman. Just a regular, regular old hyzer with a little bit of oomph. Too low. Well, too short. But hey, that's how it is. <laughs> nope. Hello. Well. Yeah. Oh, it's that far. Okay. Ah. Uh. Better bid, but still didn't get it. Nope. <laughs> See, there is no tree. Oh, that I think that's pretty good. Could I be think good. that's almost part. Yeah. Maybe um, a little short. That's good. Not too bad. That's Not really too bad good. at all. That's really good, actually. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. A little flex outside. Wow, that just did not have any glide at all. I'm not committed. Well, he's committed to putting with it, but he's not committed enough tracks to make the putts. Ah, that was that was horrible. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it got kicked down. <laughs> That's so short. So it's weird because it actually throw, it feels a lot more overstable than the launcher. But uh, I'm gonna throw the Pacific understable <laughs> and see what we can do. De vil godt lave de her tisteder her siden, at uh, modden allerede er så meget op. Mm. Det er et tegn på, at, uh, mm. at det er nogen, der har prøvet det før, der har mm. lavet dem. Hashtag sarkasme kan forekomme. Mm. So, a little bit of Annie. A little bit of a lot of Annie. And a yank. And That's I'm okay. almost as far as Stefan. <laughs> Might as well try them all. Least stable launcher. Let's God. try. Gotta throw them all. Oh. Yeah, just hold the highs in the side wind. Burnk. But definitely went further than everything else because I didn't try to flex it because I'm so bad at throwing friction. Good. Launcher, uh, natural of the launchers. We're gonna try and throw just up across there and let it get around. Why so early? Oh, uh. oh, that's pretty good. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. I still love Nordisk for a living, but I am very tired now. I've been out for many hours and I'm also hungry. So I think to make it a short, fast deal, I'm just gonna throw my Northman wingman, which is uh, the NS Plastic 5502. I'm just gonna throw it into the chains, so I'm done for the day. Or not. Or maybe. Yeah, no, it's okay. My plan. Par. So that was uh, 13 holes here at the uh, Hillhusen outside Copenhagen with. North Star only, well, with a very few exceptions, whereas Stefan was putting with the um, yeah, secret disc. Secret disc, something else. But this is, um, yeah. And this is yours, so you should have this back. Yes, but we put and, this. And uh, this, this is a little bit of a weird video because it's, it's not a sponsored video, but all the discs are provided by North Star. So yeah. thank you to North Star for uh, providing these. And, 100%. Uh, 
hundred percent. So yeah, this is more. Uh, and it is a it is a very biased review because of course we are happy about this. There's nothing there's nothing to hide about that. Is this produced in Denmark by Danes? And it's a full line, and I really I really like what he's been trying to do with with, with the discs and which direction he took them in. Um, and, and for that reason, like, yeah, I know I'm biased because I'm sponsored by the guy. But the guy has basically made discs that I already threw, but he made them in better. And the quality of the disc, for me, the plastic type, is, is like such a big deal of it. Um, a really big, big example is a Spaceline plastic. I have this Baseline uh, Spy here that has hit rocks, like in Finland and stuff. And it looks here like I can try and show it in the camera maybe a bit. Here it looks like it's really hard hit. Once I put my finger on it, I can't feel it. It holds up so well baseline plastic. Of course, you throw it into a tree from here as hard as you can into a tree there. Yeah, of course it's gonna bump up, but yeah. But yeah, the plastic feels really nice. This is my first time throwing any North Star plastic at all. And uh, the primary discs I threw were in the uh, in the premium plastic. So, uh, both the wingman and the spy and the uh, the launcher and the, and the launchers were in the Pacific. Yeah. And, but it feels really nice. I mean, for I am for uh, the people who watch my videos know that I throw a lot of uh, trilogy and uh, HC line as well. And then for putters, I use the, the baseline plastic. Um, and it's probably going to be the same for this as well. As you said yourself, putting putting with a champion. So the premium plastic is is weird some people we, like it and some people don't uh, I, I i generally don't like it because it normally makes the putter feel a bit deeper than it is but it's a nice throwing putter and i like i know he is working on them right now actually yeah. in the moment to make yeah. the the run of the normal zoom so i'm very yeah. much looking forward to getting those uh they will definitely kick out my normal putter i've already yeah. have one at home in baseline an overweight one and it's like yeah, it's pretty close to like, what would I say, to a very old P2, like the old D-Lines P2, yeah. not the new, really old ones, the yeah. cycle runs. They but the good ones. to try and cut this video a little bit short, because we can talk for hours yes, about this, and yes, this is yes. so exciting. There's going to be a video coming out after, probably, well, probably after you see this one, about uh, with an interview with Peter, uh, who's the guy behind Northstar. Uh, in the factory where you get to see some of the stuff behind the scenes uh, the video just needs a little bit of uh, proof watching first and uh, so you will so this video will come out before before the video the discs most of these discs are already in the stores at your local retailer if they don't if they don't have it ask for it because yeah. they uh, Peter will have you heavily provided us yeah. as fast as he can produce the discs um, Production is still limited to one machine only, so he's making discs almost around the clock at the moment. I know the uh, I know that the champ, the C line or the premium plastic uh, Spy, maybe also the Wingman, but at least the Spy is not in all stores yet, but it will come. Um, baseline Spy is in all stores. We, we we can we can say we can say it like this. I know exactly which stores they're in right it now. Doesn't matter. If they're, if they're not in the stores, yeah, ask, go, ask, go, go, ask go, about go and ask for them. Ask they your can, local store They can it. contact the North Star pretty easy. Find their contact guide, contact details yeah. on their homepage, and 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 they will definitely set up a deal. It's not yeah. going to be an issue. So yes, it's it's for me. It's uh, it's the uh, amazing amazing discs. I I've ended up a good example is I used to have four different molds, basically mid ranges. Now I carry three to four mid-ranges and they're all wingman. Yeah. I have wingman that is understable, straight and actually overstable. And when I need really overstable, then I just go up to a really concave uh, spy. So in, in, in that sense, it's like you can cover like almost already a whole pack. Yeah. Just quickly saying that this that I'm out right now is the launcher, is the wingman and it's the spy. They're in the shop now. They're the three most out now. He's working on the last three that's gonna be the Paladin, which you didn't see today, T30 disc, which is gonna be in every, uh, also in understable, the US, S, and OS. And then uh, there's also gonna come Zoom, and then the Pacific. So the Zoom Pacific is all good today, they're coming in the next one. Yeah, the Pacific is in production at the moment. Yeah. 
that's what that, that's, you're right, actually going to see the Pacific in the other video. And yeah. another funny story yeah, is that I Peter, today as well. yeah, really? Peter, yeah, I threw it as well. Yeah, you do. Uh, and when you get to see the other video behind the scenes, Peter is actually talking about how he, how he, yeah, he doesn't have players like uh, like Eagle or McMahon, so he can charge like 300 kronos for the disc. But he did himself manage to take down the second place in MP40 at the Danish National Championship. Yeah. Only yeah. playing Allstar. So, yeah. well, anyway, long story short, buy some Northstar. If yeah. your local retailer doesn't have it, yeah. ask for it because yeah. he will su he will supply it to anyone who wants it. Yeah. So, thank you very much, Stefan, and uh, see you in the next one. Woo!